Gustav invented this in 1922, and it quickly became one of the most popular household appliances for home cooks. It was introduced to Great Britain in 1929, and it really reached peak popularity after World War II with the Aga Company introducing different colors and different models with various oven compartments. By 1948, over 100,000 cookers were being sold worldwide, and it actually became sort of iconic. For anyone who watches The Great British Bake Off, which I don't know if you do, but Arun and I do, one of the judges, Paul Hollywood, on the show has an AGA, and he did an interview for AGA Living, which is a magazine. Mm -hmm. And he said, quote, the AGA will always be the core of the house. Even when it's not on, people will congregate around it. It's a bizarre thing. It's in the psyche. If you go to someone's house and see an aga, you gravitate towards it. I love the aga. I love the look. I love the tradition. So it's really like, again, what we were talking about before. Um, once I learned about this, I started seeing it everywhere. Like the aga stove is in all of these like kind of country homes or traditional homes. Like anyone on TikTok or Instagram who's trying to show like country living or like you know, kind of more traditional type of living, they have this aga stove. 